This deadlock match had a team filled with terrible cheaters who have no idea how to play the game. You will be confused. So it's Spirit Ivy. You have aim hacks, yet you go Spirit Ivy? That doesn't make much sense to me. There will be toxicity. He's looking at the ground. That's a little sus. Oh my. <laughs> and sadly, there will be cheating. Hayes has no idea how to press her actives. <laughs> oh my gosh, she turned into fucking spin bot mode. She should have been doing this from the start. She took seven years to start doing it. Everyone knew you were cheating. If you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. If you have any match IDs that have cheaters in them, please comment below and make sure to report the cheaters you see in this video on Discord. Though I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how to type their names. I, I couldn't tell you. All right, so apparently there were four cheaters in this game. Hayes is 100%. Wait, they lost? Wait, Vindicta a cheater? I don't, I can't really tell who the cheater, okay. I can tell you for certain, Geist is not a cheater. <laughs> Geist, Lash, Great Talon, Seven, and Paradox aren't cheaters for sure. Everyone else is on the fence though. This game is so long, 46 minutes? How's a game with four cheaters in it take that long? That's crazy. I'll tell you exactly how. It's because they suck. First up is this Vindicta. Oh, and this Vindicta is special. Not special as in she's one of a kind. Special as in I'm pretty sure she needs a full-time caretaker. Vindicta, there's no way you're hacking, man. Yeah, she's hitting the body of the fucking Guardian. There's no way. Why is she hitting the body of the Guardian? Is she just bad? Oh. What kind of hacks only hit the... She's hacking too. Now, Vindicta here doesn't have the brain power to hit the head of the Guardian. Bitch even got dollar store cheats that can't hit the Guardian. So they, their personalities mix together quite well. But it gets worse. Each player in this match plays an important part in the grand design. Vindicta's part is being a fucking moron. I don't know if this is the worst cheater I've ever seen or not. Because that is ridiculous. Like, her her cursor's swapping so much she can't even deal damage to the person. She has no items! Go buy items! Oh my god, dude. No wonder she's lo she took so seven years to get that goddamn tower. Her autos do 20 damage. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're, you got them, buddy. Your fucking zero item build is working out. She honestly needs the cheats to play the game. I, you know, I think she's an exception. I think we should allow her to keep playing with cheats. By the way, if anyone has one, Ivy over here is on the lookout for a straight jacket, as I'm fairly certain she's schizophrenic. Uh, that's funny. All the cheaters are just farming. Dude, you can't... What is he doing? These, these cheaters are a completely different breed of people. These guys are ridiculous. They have no idea what's going on. I'm actually surprised they even know the fact that the fucking gambling machines are there. It must have been Ivy's demons who told her that she should build spirit. Why would you build spirit when you're aimbotting it? It just doesn't make sense to me. So it's spirit Ivy who's cheating. Wait, you have aim hacks. You go Spirit Ivy? That doesn't make much sense to me. Like, your whole, your whole thing is that you're literally cheating with Aimbot, and you're going a Spirit build that has nothing to do with your Aimbot. Wraith seems to forget who she is and forget that she's even playing a game. Oh my, look at the... The cheater is AFK, and it's instinctually farming for her. It's farming the orbs, but she's AFK. That's ridiculous. <laughs> she either has Alzheimer's or this is the next low MMR best strat. I can't tell just yet. So far on the special needs bus, we have Wraith for her Alzheimer's, Vindicta for her straight up mental ineptitude, and Ivy for her schizophrenia. But who's the driver? Hayes. From watching this game, I've been able to observe exactly the type of person Hayes is. 
She's the exact stereotype of someone who cheats. Hayes has the ego. She has the pride. She has the aim bot. She has the spin bot. She has the speed hacks. She has the parry time hack. I think Hayes truly believes that she's legit. Until she starts losing. And then she brings out Beyblade mode. Hayes has no idea how to press her actives. <laughs> oh my god, she turned into fucking spin bot mode. Oh god, look at she, look at her go. Go, Hayes. <laughs> oh. How does she lose when she... She should have been doing this from the start. <laughs> what is she doing? Why did she do this? She took seven years to start doing it. Everyone knew you were cheating. Oh my. Another fucking 30 minutes added to the timer. God damn it. You bitch. You're such a loser, man. Now, if you're the yellow team, morale is low. Clits are hidden. Dicks are soft. Erections are dysfunctional. But remember when I said that each player has their own part? Infernus could be considered our main character, our hero. Against all odds, he starts to win against the cheaters with the help of Seven and Paradox. Oh, he's just chilling with the other team now. Look at him. Is this how? Is this the turning point of the game? Were Paradox the Seven that you know? pinnacle to the, the completion of the game that them stopping makes the other team win Parado oh, wait he's killing paradox now. oh i see what's happening infernus is killing seven and paradox over and over to get the money and i see that's how he's getting so rich seven and paradox are letting them letting infernus kill them but even a hero has a big flaw now infernus's flaw is that he's kind of he's he's racist he's looking at the ground that's a little sus oh my God. what the that's outrageous now the game goes back and forth for 46 minutes and each person has their own rival dude just run use your teleport stop trying to run up there oh my god this Wraith is... Doesn't use her teleport. Doesn't use her ult. Yeah, teabag him. I don't I want to congratulate you, but you're racist. <laughs> okay, go wait. Wraith versus Lady Geist? Come on. Come on, Lady Geist. We'll pretend we didn't see that. We'll pretend we didn't see that one. I won't... I won't... I won't let you get seen, Lady Geist. I won't show it and I won't show it. Don't worry. Still hasn't used Silencer. Still hasn't, especially when he's channeling. Use your Silencer. Oh my god. After each cheater has tried to 1v6 the game, the yellow team finally catches them off guard without Haze, so they can try and end the game, but Haze won't let it go without getting dizzy. But that's just me. Wait, she stopped spinbotting, I just realized. Does her spinbotting have a cooldown? Yeah, they got caught out again. Ivy getting caught out again, you lovely, lovely. Ivy still... Investing in spirit. Alright, Hayes, let's see it. Let's see the 1v6. Oh, back to spin botting. Okay. Hayes, it's all for it's all you now. This is your game. This is your moment. This is your clip. This is gonna go in the montage. Holy shit, why have you been doing that? Can you only Is there a cooldown? <laughs> why have you been just go kill them? Come on guys! End the game! Win it! Alting? She's bombed? Teleports out? Oh... And they lost. Ease. GG, GG. GG Ease. Ease losers, stupid cheater. Sad. Ease, ease, oof, ease. <laughs> that is actually... Insane. Well, I think honestly, I think it's I think the real heroes of the game 
like on what won the game were Paradox and Seven. Those guys were the real Giga Chads. They inted so that the other team could win. They didn't. They don't care about their profile stats. They don't care about the dub ski. They care about righteous. They care about what's right. And the uh, the honorable players are of course. Vats and uh, Mesa Picot 1976. These guys are both weebs too. <laughs> Who has a anime profile picture? You gotta be you gotta be careful for the anime profile pictures. Oh my god, this game is littered with anime profile pictures, actually. Is that a Minecraft picture? What is that? Well, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Peace.